on September the 23rd, the UK government announced a 50 billion US dollars in unfunded tax cuts. Kingsland Drinks, one of the biggest wine butlers in the UK, was hit as the pound slumped against a strong US dollars. As a business which fundamentally imports a large quantity of the value of our product, obviously the importance of sterling strength has a big impact on terms of our overall market. Ultimately, we import about 20% of the wine that we actually sell in the UK is actually denominated in US dollar, either because it becomes from the USA or because it comes from Chile or Argentina, which also they buy, uh, we buy from them in US dollar. Effectively, that means if sterling gets weakened, I'm afraid our product becomes more expensive and that ultimately will feed through in the longer term through to supermarkets and through to their customer on shelf price. As a new Prime Minister, Rishi Sunak has urged to stabilize an economy sliding toward recession. When he was a Treasury Chief, Sunak became popular among the public by handing out billions in support to shut out businesses and laid-off workers during the COVID-19 pandemic. I will place economic stability and confidence at the heart of this government's agenda. This will mean difficult decisions to come. But you saw me during COVID doing everything I could to protect people and businesses with schemes like furlough. There are always limits, more so now than ever. But I promise you this, I will bring that same compassion to the challenges we face today. On the contrary, Sunak's political opponents already depict him as out of touch because of his privileged private school background and vast wealth. However, he promised to form a government which have integrity, professionalism, and accountability at every level.